New developments now on a breaking news story that we've been tracking overnight, a fire at a townhome complex. Indeed, and now we have an update on the condition of the firefighter hurt. The flames shot into the night sky at Michigan, Michigan Street and Commonwealth. Channel 2's Vincent Crivelli is live on scene with the latest on that firefighter's condition. Vincent, good morning. Brandon, Sophia, firefighters have just left the scene. Take a look behind me. You can see foam mixed in with burnt pieces of wood and also who just arrived to the scene, a number of utility workers who will be looking over the electricity. Under the morning sun, the aftermath is clear. A massive overnight fire collapsed a townhouse under construction. Authorities say this is where the fire started. Now foam drenches the charred wood. To the left, another townhouse under construction. It's still standing, but I'm told the structure will be condemned. Three other occupied units were damaged. That's five units total, each worth close to a million dollars. All right, guys, I want to show you something. This is where the fire started. Now we're going to zoom out, and over here is where one of the embers landed, causing even more flames. At its height, the fire's flames were 30 feet high. Firefighters worked quickly and hit the blaze from below and above. It took them about an hour and a half to put out most of the flames. Now the four-story townhouse is reduced to rubble. Neighbors stop, stare, and chat amongst themselves, hoping everyone here had insurance and thankful no one lost their life here in the ferocious flames. And one firefighter was injured battling this blaze, but I learned just minutes ago that he has been released from the hospital. For now, reporting live in Montrose, Vincent Crivelli, KPRC, Channel 2 News.